My name is Vanessa Stewart, a member of the Walters Kluwer CCH training and consulting team. In the following video, I will show you how to split an individual return with a status of married filing jointly into two new separate returns for the taxpayer and spouse using ProSystem FX Tax. With this feature, it allows the taxpayer's return to be created as a new version of the existing joint return and the spouse's return is created as a new return. The joint original return version, however, is not changed. It is important to note the basis for segregating the return information is the existing TS, TSJ, and FSO code fields found on the various federal, state, and city worksheets. These codes determine the allocation of income and deduction entries to either the taxpayer, spouse, or if they'll be divided equally. For example, if we look at our interest input, we have allocated each interest income item to the proper individual. After completing the married filing jointly return, we can verify if it would be advantageous to file married filing separate returns by viewing the Federal Tax Comparison Worksheet. To turn on the Optimization Worksheet, in your Worksheet Inputs, select Category General, Worksheet Return Options, Section 9, enter a Yes in Line 1 and make a selection in Line 2 as needed. Calculate your return, navigate to the Government Forms from the left navigational panel, under the Federal folder and right below the Return Summary subfolder, you will locate the Federal Tax Comparison for Married Filing Joint and Separate Work Paper. Once you are ready to split a joint return, select from the menu bar File Split Joint Return. At the confirmation prompt, select Yes to split the return. If this is the first time this return is being split, you will be prompted to enter a client ID for the spouse's tax return. Select OK to complete the split process. When the split is complete, a summary dialog shows the return versions resulting from the split. You then can enter each return separately and process them. You can re-enter the joint return and split it again. Each time you do, you are given the option of overriding the previously split returns or creating different versions of the returns. Please note, you cannot split a return that has been created as a result of a split. And for our pay as you process customers, the married filing joint return must be authorized before it can be split. Thank you for viewing this video. I hope that you have found it helpful. For additional training resources, click the link below to visit our training and consulting webpage.